Hi, I'm Michael. I'm Nash. I'm Isaiah. And today we have a three of us in the video, which is a special treat. Uh, today's game is called Home Sweet Home. Now to play it, you need a deck of cards, and we've got all the cards in there except for the jokers. A hundreds chart. Um, you, we've got a nice laminate one. You can print one of these off the internet. Very easy to find. A um, piece of paper and pencil for keeping score. And then each player needs a counter, and the counter is their home, and uh, a little person. So, you know, Lego person, whatever you want to use, a brick, doesn't matter. All right, who's going to go first? I can. Can I please say? You go first, Isaiah. Now, Isaiah's job is to try and put his home somewhere on the hundreds chart. <laughs> Twenty. Okay, now Isaiah's job is to turn over cards, and whatever he turns over, he moves that many spaces. Now, the, I what? If I get a queen. So don't worry about that in the moment, darling. What's the What's the bear? What's the worst one you can turn over? A king. The king is a bear. If you get a bear, then your person has to move all the way back. To Zero, and then it's the other person. And you don't get any points, do you? Yeah. Okay, so start turning over cards, Isaiah. Sue? Beautiful, keep going. King! Okay, now, so because you've got a king, he loses all of those points. He goes back to the start, and it's now Nash's turn. So, Nash, where are you going to put your house? Where is mine? Oh, it's over here. I took it off you. Okay, where are you putting your house? I'm 30. Okay, I'm 30, so you start back here at zero as well. 10. 9. 8. So, I don't count. So, yeah. 19 plus 8. 27, yeah. I get 30 points. Okay, so he made it to 30, which is where he put his house. So Nash would score 30 points, and now it goes back to Isaiah. Now, this game is a little bit of addition, but it's mostly a game about chance and probability. So today you've got to work out where's the best place to put this house of yours. Now remember, we've had one king go already. Wow. Okay, go. Start turning over. Queen. Okay, now hold on. So if you get a jack, a jack means you go back five spaces. That's queen. And if you get a queen, it means you go back ten spaces. So he goes back. He can't go lower than zero, but you're still alive. The bear hasn't eaten you. Yeah. So put it out so we can see. So 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. I made it! Okay, so Isaiah would score 12 points. So it's 30 to 12. And now it's Nash's turn to take your stuff off, Isaiah. Now we keep playing until this deck runs out of cards. Okay, so Nashi, 30 plus 19. 20. I don't have a number. No, 49. Beautiful. Alright, Isaiah, your turn, Bubs. So just put it down so we can see it. Oh! oh. Alright, so Isaiah gets a zero. So he still keeps his 12 points from his, from the previous round. He just doesn't add to it because he banks those points. Alright, now she... Oh, oh, oh. oh, yeah. Where are you putting your... Now that one, we're going sh to shuffle the deck again. <laughs> you can't look at the first card. I'm going to put it on Because I'm winning, I, there's, there's a few more kicks, so we're going to use two. Uh, Ten. 
Okay, so you, you did have it on 20, but you switched it to 10. So I'm interested. Tell us why did you make that move? Because we've used only two kings and we're halfway through the deck. And I'm winning. So you've got a nice lead, haven't you? Yeah. So does that mean you're going to try and take more of a risk? Or would that mean that you're going to try to be more safer? More safer. Yes, you've already got a lead, right? Okay, all right, let's see if that works. So 10. Eight. One. Oh, God. Four. Okay, so 10 more points. Isaiah, he's on 50. Okay, so as you can see, we're almost out of cards. So the game goes until the deck runs out. When the deck runs out, you stop. And if the points aren't already in the bank, you don't get the points. Uh, so, the, and the other thing to just highlight is, it, it's a little bit of mental addition, a little bit of two-digit addition on paper, but it's much more a game about probability. So working out where to put your counter to maximize the points that you might bank knowing how many kings are still left in the deck. So it's probably more a probability game than it is a mental addition game. Now, Isaiah, it's 89 to 42. It's your turn, bud. Where are you going to put this thing? Our final score is Nash 99 to Isaiah 42. And then we can shuffle them up and we could play again. So that is... Home sweet home. Thanks for playing and we'll see you next time. Bye.